I think it has changed um, quite a bit. Um, when you look at um, the, the banking side, I think they have a strong appetite f um, to do leverage finance. Um, we see them um, offering you know, quite aggressive conditions. Um, when you look at the leverage multiples um, today, they're uh, close to those uh, prevailing at the peak uh, of the market in, in like 2007. Um, we have seen in, in, in the Swiss market, um, even for small deals, EBITDA multiple um, north of four times. And for larger deals, all the way up to, to six times, I think that is, um, is um, you know, shows how much liquidity is in the market. And of course, you know, the interests are still at a very low, at a very low level. Well, for me, unfortunately, it's more refinancing than buyouts. I think uh, M&A um, volume is still down this year. Um, by I think the first half was about a quarter down compared to last year. Uh, and and the, the private equity funds are mainly using it to, to refinance. But, you know, when you look at the dry powder in, in, in private equity funds, I think there's still a lot of money there that needs to be invested. Um, they also have an... Uh, a lot of portfolio companies which need to be sold. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm rather confident that this will turn into an M&A deal flow as well in next year. I think it's still the, the confident in, in, into the economic outlook. I mean, of course, we are hearing in the newspapers that it's getting better. There's, for, you know, early signs that showing a recovery, but then, you know, a lot of private equity still have portfolio companies um, which are struggling. Um, then there's also the critical voices that are saying, um, you know, the, the real problems haven't been solved. So I think confidence is not quite back yet. And uh, the outlook of, of, of the corporates is, is not really predictable yet. I think that's what's holding us back. Like typical in, in, in capital markets, you know, when, when the confidence is there again, then everybody seems to have it um, kind of overnight. And um, so when this, you know, when it's really coming, it, it's difficult to say. I mean, we're seeing, um, you know, quite some progress in the economy in the US and, and there is positive signs in, in Europe and I think if there's no further turbulence, uh, you know, um, I hope that we're going to see the recovery in, in 2014.